Morning all, Club Dig. Um, no Fiona this time, she's out busy doing something or other, I can't remember what it is now. Um, it's going to be the usual, uh, find anything decent you'll see it, and of course you'll see a close up. Um, Facebook, I've created a Facebook page, um, I've had it ages now, uh, but not many people know about it. So if you're on Facebook, go and do a search for Archer and Mega Donkey, my username on YouTube. Um, like the page and you'll be first to know anything new going on like if there's a new video I post it on there um, photos of finds I post it on there if I've tried dog shit I post it on there <laughs> maybe not so let's crack on um, show you the first finds and then anything decent from then first target don't know what it is pewter I think a pewter disc looks like we've got the first coin of the day not by going. Oops, I can't get all of it. Don't know what that is. Worn. Very worn, that's what it is. Nope, no idea. It's an interesting piece of uh, <laughs> artifact. I have no idea what that is. I'll show you close up. Always recheck your holes. <laughs> so there's the other part of it. I shall, uh, I show you, shall show you the uh, the two pieces together. It's obviously broke off there. So uh, interesting. This is our site officer, Mr. T. Um, do you have a license for what? Filming me. Yeah, actually I do. Listen to that now. Listen to that. It sounded rusty on me, he's right. Two way, two way rusty. <sighs> Get off the spider. I've got spider favour. They seem to be liking me today. You've got lots of batteries in your camera. Oh yeah. Oh it's exciting. You see that gold there. You mean <laughs> rust? <laughs> That's a rusty sound, if ever I heard one. See that there? Lovely <laughs> rusty it's a, nail. It's a complimentary nail to go with my other one. <laughs> Looks like the uh, back end of a 303. Fired one. We've got a target down here somewhere, which sounds like it's very close to the surface. So I thought I'll do the... Uh, The live on cover because he's giving me a 22. Oh, what have we got? Oh, no. Oh, whoa, hang on. Yeah. Strap end. Yep, that was nice. Strap end, look. I'm almost certain it is because it's. Oops. Um... Yeah, because you can see through there. Nice one. I don't know if there's a pattern. If there's any detail, I'll, uh, I'll show you close up. As you can see, we've changed fields. Where is it? Oh, there we go. Oh. Also, I'm just a bit of lead. <clears throat> so I got a guy, uh, clod clips. Something here. 
small, whatever it is. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh my, oh my God. Oh, bollocks, oh. Look at that, that's, I'm sure that's a silver button. Or is it pewter? <laughs> I can't believe to say bollocks. <laughs> that looks silver. Look at that for a button. But I reckon it's pewter. When that came out, I was just like, hammered. No, bugger. Oh. Okay, thought I'd do a bit of a roundup. Um, that thing, it was obviously one piece. Now I'm guessing it's some sort of uh, book thing. Off a book, maybe? Don't know. So, interesting all the same. Here's the um, strap end, medieval, so someone's saying. Somewhere around 1300s, 13th century maybe. They're always nice. Quite a few buttons. There's another one just found. Um, you can tell this one's pretty much pewter. Um, but when I saw that come out on the ground, I thought, ooh, we're in for a bit of silver. No. And just one coin, well knackered. Um, I don't know what it is. Could be William, William III, George III, who knows? It's um, knackered. <laughs> well and truly gone. Okay, uh, thanks for watching. Look forward to your comments. Catch you later, guys and girls.